Okay, question three, we've got a, a um, container in the form of a right circular cone. The angle between the axis and the stunt height is alpha, where 10 alpha is a half. It's empty, liquid is added, 14 centimetres cubed per minute. Show that the volume in the liquid when the depth is x is given by V is 1 over 12 pi x cubed. Well, that doesn't seem to have any mention. That's height, doesn't have any mention of radius in there. Um, but of course, as, as this goes down, this triangle is always, this angle is always going to be alpha, isn't it? That angle there uh, will remain at alpha. And if we've got that 10 alpha is a half, well, according to what we've got here, there's x and there's the radius of our um, liquid. Uh, 10 alpha is opposite over adjacent, is r over x. So if we rearrange that, that tells us, I think, that r is equal to a half x. So that's crucial to get to start with. So the volume of liquid is one third pi r squared h. So that is one third pi r squared, a half of x squared times h, which is x. We've got a third times a quarter, gives us a twelfth times pi x squared times x is x cubed, as required. Good stuff. Find the rate at which the depth is increasing at the instant when the depth is 8. Give your answer in centimetres per minute, correct two decimal places. Well, we're, all, we're in the right units, minutes and time there. We've got liquid is added at the rate of 14 centimetres cubed per minute. So that is the rate that volume... Um, is added, yep, so this is this is dv by dt is 14. We've got v here, so dv by dx is 3 twelfths pi x squared, or 1 quarter pi x squared. Um, we need the rate at which the depth is increasing, so we need dx by dt, we have v on the top twice, we have t on the bottom twice, so dv over dt is dv by dx times dx by dt, uh, which gives us um, that 14 is uh, dv by dx, 1 quarter pi x squared times dx by dt, so dx by dt is, if we rearrange that, that is, four, what's 4 times 14, uh, 56. Hang on, I don't mean that, do I? Yeah, I do. Yeah, 56 over pi times 8 squared, because we're doing it when the depth is 8. And this gives us 56 over pi times 8 squared is 0 0.2785 and the question did say give your answer correct to two decimal places so dx by dt is 0 0.28 uh, centimetres per minute. Aha! Job's done. That's maths.